But I don't want a boat. A <laughs> boat? We're headed to a settlement called Lagra. I met a boatman there called Thomas who knows these waters like the back of his hand. Why do we need a boat? So we can attack Bronte's mansion from the swamp. Catch him off guard. He knows we survived the trolley station. Yeah. So he'll be expecting some kind of reprisal. All right. Why don't we just bring okay. Uncle? Okay, makes sense. <laughs> so I can See, keep antagonizing him the entire time. Capacity for rational thought, Arthur. I just want to bring Uncle along and antagonize him. Williamson. Hello, Arthur. Fucking Pierce is yelling about his okay, stew. Follow me. Like, Calm down. That's good. Like serious stuff happening. Hey, everybody, eat my stew. Yeah, there's a girl. Thank you. For what? For taking my side back there. It ain't about sides. I didn't have a choice. Feels like Jose has lost his spine. This move on Bronte. Is it for the bank job? Or revenge for what happened at the trolley station? Both. Neither. What does it matter? We need to hit that bank. And Bronte has the police and just about everything else in San Denis in his back pocket. He also set us up. And lest we forget, took young Jack. You're right I out of my butt. We just got a lot it's, of pots nice on stew. the boil, giving all the folks who's out gunning for us. You all seem to have forgotten how money is made and what it takes to support 20 You say people. this, but motherfucker, I have more money than the camp. 20 people a new life overseas. With all due respect, Dutch, is this Tahiti plan really going to work out? You tell me, Arthur. Is it? Have some goddamn faith. I am bending over backwards to make a future for us. I know, but... But, 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 when did you become so small-minded? If you'd rather we break up the family, go our separate ways, just tell me. Of course not. This isn't a prison camp. I am not forcing anybody to stay. So either we're in this together, working together to get out together, or we're not. There simply isn't a reality in which we do nothing and get everything. I know. You're right. Just feels like we're on borrowed time again. I mean, the old Driscoll's found us. Yeah. We need to move and soon. Haven't I made that clear? I feel like I'm going in circles with all of you. Micah is the only oh, one left boy. with any loyalty. Now, that ain't fair. You are talking like John. I swear that woman is poisoning him against me. I've seen it before. This is where Dutch is starting to problem? lose his shit. There ain't a problem. You think Micah would question going after Bronte? No. He'd say, let's go. I'm here, ain't I? I've been at your side for 20 years. I know. I... I... I'm sorry. He's cracking, son. It's just the endless debate about everything is wearing me down. The others, I can take. But when you're not behind me, it hurts. I'm behind you. Blackwater. Literally. Valentine. Rhodes. Sean. Kieran. I promise. None of it will be in vain. Yeah, Karen's was we the most fucked up so it. far of death. Know, like, Jesus. <laughs> Each time you guys do something, get money, that's been putting it inside of the chest, the inside the of the camp. Yeah, the camp has, like, very little money anyway. Whoa. He's just holding on to his own share. You done good, girl. Thomas, it is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Dutch. Thomas, have you met Arthur? Arthur? Thomas is quite the boatman. He's going to help us get close to our prey. The other night, we had quite the adventure fishing for catfish. Now, my friend, 
Can I call in that favor? What do you need? You know Angelo Bronte. Well, exactly. We need to make a social call. We were hoping you could row us in quietly one evening around the back of his house. Well, if anyone can, I can. We'll pay you for your trouble. If you bringing him trouble, it won't be no trouble for me. Good. My business partner, Jules, he's out on the skiff. I need to check with him. Plus, I need to check the traps. Would you come with me? Of course. Arthur? Yeah, fuck no. Why not? <laughs> Shouldn't take too long if we can find it. He live. Mind you, there's a lot of gators. Uncommon number, big ones. Oh Great. boy. Come now, Arthur. It'll take more than a prehistoric reptile to scare you, Shirley. Well, I just want to see you meet your match when it comes to a, an aging predator with a big mouth, Dutch. Arthur here is something of a comedian, Thomas, more of a jester than a gunslinger. Well, Dutch, I'm probably a better well, gunslinger so than you. Dutch. This way. Come on, this way. Follow me here. And stay on the higher ground. You call this ground? It feels like water to me. Down here, we can't be too picky there, Mr. Arthur. Got a couple of crayfish traps up ahead. Dutch, you keep a lookout for company, Mr. Arthur. Check the traps with me. Oh, of course, I get to come out and look. Hmm, what's going on in here? This one's empty. All right, I got a few more set over this way. Come on. I don't want to know what just touched my leg. Who's my penis, Dutch? Dutch. You show you the right fellas to be going out to Angelo Brunty? Oh, he's much more the kind of reptile I can handle. Now stay close. Make sure you follow my line. Oh, I fully intend to, Thomas. You too, Mr. Arthur. You can see why evening swamp waiting hasn't caught on as a pastime, can't you? I love it out here. Peaceful. Nobody bothering you now. Except for the night folk sometimes. The night folk. I ran into them, I think. They attacked me while I was trying to do shit. Well, this just gets better and better. I've also had people threaten me when I tried to camp once. Out in the swamp. They were telling me it was their territory, then I shot the fuck out of them. Whoa. Stop where you are. That's a gator. Just stay as still as you can. All right, let's keep moving. I All right, move by. A small island up here. I don't know what's taking Jewel so long with that boat. I think we are all equally keen to find him. Ugh. Mr. Arthur, this trap is stuck in the mud. It happens. Ugh. Oh, yeah, sure, I'd love to. Ooh. Guess something didn't want to be caught. My God. So it's true. What is? There's been talk of a big old bull. But people talk a lot of nonsense. I guess this was... No, but only some huge could do this. Oh. Fantastic. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. Should we just keep moving? I don't really want to hang around here much longer. All right. I suppose this can wait. Let's go. Oh fuck, you don't get lost. Pretty fucked out here. 
Oh, thanks, Dutch. Hold up. Hey. Hmm. My God, there's no shortage of them. Good eating. Us or them? Exactly. Come on. Oh, just before I don't want it to go out of sync. Let's reset. I gotta make sure with that HDMI cord that that is adjusted. <laughs> he just wants a hug. So at home here, you take the right. We'll go left. What? Just keep your eyes open. Gotta get a run of getting that, it, adjusting that cord. I've just been lazy. I gotta set me on my own. What assholes. So, this, this shit has destroyed my gun. Hey! Someone there? I don't even wanna clean it yet because. Oh, I just realized it's not even, like, I don't even want that fucking gun. But, just swimming around has destroyed my condition on my gun. Hello? Hey! Someone there? Up here! That must be him. Playing around the swamp. The Fuck it. Fucks with that. Hey, you in the tree. What are you doing? There's a monster. A monster. You okay up there? There's a monster. Where? Master, it nearly ate me. Hey, where'd he go? It's, it's out there. What? A big gator. Biggest I ever saw. Big and nasty. Knocked me off the boat and chased me over here. You must be Jules. Yes. Where is the boat? Over there. I ran. I. Oh. I don't have the weaponry okay. to fight it. <laughs> and uh, where'd this monster swim off to? I think that way. I got the scale. It's over here. <laughs> Stop. Got it loose. Go. Good man. All right. Let's get back to the dock. Yes, please. Let's go. Thank God. Hold on. I need to use my guns. So, uh... Who are these fellas, Thomas? Two new friends of mine. I'll explain later. Jules, we are very happy to have finally made your acquaintance. I thought I was gonna be out here all night. What was you doing hiding up in the tree, boy? Sucking this dick. was huge, Thomas. Twice as big as I ever seen. Twice as angry, too. None. Oh, boy. Now oh, what? I think we hit a tree stump. Yeah, I thought we cleared. You're gonna need to jump in and pull us free. Me? Yeah, just do it. Won't take you a minute, boy. Go on. This is a bad idea. <laughs> we'll see any giant monster <laughs> long before it gets anywhere near you. Got a couple of crack gunslingers here with the guns loaded. You'll be fine. Yeah, my gun isn't loaded. Yeah, neither did you. Well, my gun is, Jules but it's in poor condition. I can't clean it right now. Oh boy. Jules? Shit. He won't kid. No, I'm going in. No, no, we can't lose the boat. Arthur will go. Oh, oh what the quit. fuck? Dutch. Go on, Arthur. What the hell am I gonna do? Fucking scare it? Booga booga booga. 
I'm running. I can't. What am I gonna do? I have the rustiest gun in the world on my side. Yeah, why is it on me? Help! Help! I'm coming. Help! Help! Get, help me! I got you, son. I got you. Oh, God, no. Dutch! Shoot Fire something! Oh, 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 oh. Fire off a couple of warning shots just to pretend you care. Oh God, no. I got you covered. Please hurry. Yeah. Just act like you give a shit. Oh. Oh God, no. Please Take hurry. It, oh. oh God. Get off as as you can. Come on. I am moving as fast as me holding a man on. I'm out of stamina. I'm pushing so hard. Put him here. Come on. Give him here. Come on. Come on, quickly. Quickly. Hurt pretty bad. This should be okay. Oh my god, that light's gone. Shoot that thing. Finish that son of a bitch. Hold on, Dutch. Gotta clean. My leg. My leg. Oh. Well, I'm dead. Well, probably shouldn't be cleaning. My gun is in like piss ass condition. Just to hold on, I gotta walk, rub it down. Finish that. Son of a bitch, Arthur. I think he's going. Shit, that is one big old gate. Oh, your boy doesn't look too good there. Here, take this. Try to stop the bleeding. You're gonna be okay, son. You're gonna be okay. Just thank your old Uncle Dutch. I heard that. Oh, God. There's still a lot of blood. You need to put pressure on it. I've stopped the bleeding. I think he'll be okay if he don't get a fever. We can bring down a fever. A fever is the least of our worries. Look who's back. Come on, God man. My gun Every bullet you got is him. in shit condition. Even yours are Dutch. I see the Shit. rust on those things. At least I'm not the only one when swimming in this shit. It went downhill. Okay, I think it's had enough. Now, Jesus, can we get back now? Whew. Be okay, kid. Oh. Sorry, Jules. Guess all them stories was true. Big and bad. That's unusual. Normally, the little one's angry. 
Big ones is lazy. Well, I guess he never outgrew his anger. Kind of oh, reminds man. me of you, Arthur. You know, I don't think I've ever seen you squeal before, Dutch. <laughs> I weren't the one squeal. Yeah, well, you weren't in the water with him. And this poor boy was nearly dinner. Can we get some help? Jules has been bitten. Oh, my God. There's a monster out here. He's been bitten, but he's alive. Uh, he's infected. Got to put him down. Feed him garlic for the infection. Thank you. Both of you. I'm at your service anytime you need. Thank you, Thomas. Where can we find you? You just meet me back here. Very good. Can one of you help me put the boat back out? Sure. I'm going to head back to camp and placate the irritable Miss O'Shea, who's causing more trouble. I'll collect the boys. Meet you back here, Arthur. <clears throat> Mr. Arthur? <clears throat> Old Bronte. A bad man. I know. Killed some good folks. Hurt a lot of people. Well, he definitely lacks a certain charm. I'll see you soon. You be safe. Oh. You got monsters out here. Well. I'm from the guy who's going out there. On the boat after all that shit. Dirty. My iron shotgun. Almost looks like it's silver, but it's just iron and black. Black and steel. God, I had Midnight's pistol, but I don't give a shit for those. My horse is all dirty. Let's get you looking good. Yeah, yeah. That brush was still on my hand. Been a while, even though you're the only thing I ride. That looks like we're gonna be uh, robbing the bank. So now, even though I said I was gonna be done after the like last two missions, this will be the last one I do for tonight. Yep. It feels like this one will probably be the big one that uh, that will have a lot of shit go on. not jump in the swamp water. Last thing I want is to fuck up my guns. Also, they're all on my back, suddenly. So, Dutch, what's the heady like, anyhow? I have no idea, but I hear it's paradise. What the hell is your problem? Arthur, there you are. Come on. <clears throat> Thomas, let's <laughs> Revenge is a dish best eat. Hello there, John Marston. Bill and Lenny and uh, <laughs> me. Hey, Bill, you were a sharpshooter in the cavalry, weren't you? What? 
When we get there, maybe you could help with the suppression fire. I never said I was no sharpshooter. Oh, that's right. W what was it? The nation's most loyal latrine digger, wasn't that it? <laughs> yeah, well, I fought, and I fought well. So you always tell us. You taught me something you could do with learning. <laughs> Them Indians were savages. Watch your mouth there, boy. Watch it. Only type of savage in these parts are moonshine, swilling pompous, inbred locals. Dutch, I saw things out there. I don't doubt you saw things, Bill, but your tiny little mind was too small to comprehend what you saw. What you saw was people who lost everything to savagery, savagery of peasants. Failures come from Europe to reap some awful vengeance on God's last creation. Interesting way you boys got to prepare for a killing. I'm sorry I wasted my life trying to teach you boys. Love you though, I do. <clears throat> well, love, leave and love aside. Eh? <coughs> you think we got this? Don't you never leave love aside, Arthur. Well, it's all I don't have got. any love. <laughs> I'm alone, all right? Pick us up yonder. I got you. Thank you. Good luck to you. God, I hope they don't see me in my gold and silver shotgun on my back. I didn't say is Bill able to get over the wall? Lenny, Bill. You're with me. Arthur, John, you take the left side. If you see a shot, you take it. Okay? Good luck, gentlemen. Let's go. <clears throat> Let's go. Just casually walking. Find some cover. Two up ahead. You got a shot on him? Something creepy about these statues. <laughs> you don't like naked. You taking them or me? It's like someone's looking at you. Oh, I guess we're just going right into it. Gotta be so fucking foggy. Ah, but who wants revenge more, Marston or Dutch? The butler! I like that I could just keep firing now and that. Very nice. This is not over yet. Head to the house. Oh, it's, uh. shoot that lock, Arthur. What the fuck? Good. I'm sorry. Why did they Now take that damn door in. All right, but what about my They just took away my gun for this fucking double barrel. Come like on, what the hell? What an asshole. Okay, nope. Still a double barrel. I mean, yay, I love the double barrel, but fucking Christ. I was planning on using my obnoxious gold and silver gun. Oh, so they wanted me to use a double barrel. I have a sawed off. Ah, 
I don't speak your language. Bunch of goddamn jokers! Kill you all! That guy doesn't even have a head. Oh my god, he's done. Manny, keep that door covered. Well, they damn. must be up there. Let's go. Name your price, every man of a price. Eh? Okay, okay, no, I surrender. I surrender. I... Should we kill him? Nah, let's take him to Dutch. I don't want the Mauser pistol. I ain't touching that piece of shit. You already touched him. You punched him. $155. Well, that's my money now. to have a little chat, Mr. Bronte. I hear a lot of lawmen coming. Put your guns down. Uh-oh. Come on, Morgan! We're getting the hell out of here! Die! Stay with me, Arthur. I'm trying. You guys need to get better at shooting fucking guys. I'm literally killing them when I have someone on my shoulders. drew an outline of his head. Keep moving. Quick, get our new friend on that boat before any more show. Put him in front. Bill, you help. Got him? Oh, come on, Lenny. from where I'm sitting. You're the one deserving of pity, my friend. <laughs> all your men. All your money. It weren't no match for a bunch of bumpkins. You are nothing. You do nothing. You mean nothing. You stand for nothing. Me? I run a city. <laughs> and when the law catch up to you, you will die like nothing. I am this country. You, you, you are what people are running from. I possess things that you will never understand. You don't even possess your own men. A thousand dollars to the man who kills him and sets me free. What are you going to say now? They are even bigger fools than you. No doubt. The law will find you. Already, the dogs are on the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're right. You are so right. <laughs> they are good at smelling filth, huh? So <laughs> filth... Has got to be this Our friends of Pinkerton's gonna come and rescue you, you repulsive little maggot! Call them now! You call them! Jesus. Part of your 
philosophy books cover feeding the fellow. The goddamn alligator, Dutch. The part that covers weakness. That part. I don't know. Well, I do. It ain't nice. I know it. But it is us or him. I figure it might as well be him. At least I grabbed that 150 whatever dollars off him before we dumped him to an alligator. Well, that was hectic. And it looks like for the next mission, we'll be, uh, we'll probably be hitting that bank, because that was the plan, was to get rid of him and then do the bank. So, I think that's, uh, that's what we'll do next time. Um, just because I'm pretty exhausted as it is. And stuff. But man, just, you're already seeing the parts where people are like a little bit hesitant of Dutch's, uh, Dutch's actions, he start to crack around different parts now with all the shit just piling on to him. So, been pretty awesome, but also crazy to see. I've been enjoying it. Morning to you. Good morning. But yeah. Hi there. Hi, Parsons. You okay? Harrison's I thought we were here. safe here. <sighs> Never make that mistake. Night, have your Paris. I was gonna eat the fucking stew. It's being prepared. It's done. God, I can't wait to see how you die if it even happens, or you just run away like a bitch. So we all know most of these people probably die since Red Dead One is the aftermath. Damn it! I fucking wanted that goddamn. Sit right here. I sit on this box, contemplate my life. Piece of shit. He took. He took my stew. Took my goddamn stew. <laughs> 